I'm Louise Bordeaux. In the news today, Microsoft is stepping up its gaming. It'll be acquiring Activision Blizzard in an all-cash transaction valued at $68.7 billion. Of course, the deal is raising some eyebrows because of Activision's historically toxic culture and possible antitrust issues. Still, if all goes according to plan, the deal should close sometime next year. Goldman Sachs is going against other experts and predicting the price of oil will continue to go up. The bank claims the price of a barrel of oil will reach $100 by the third quarter of this year and $105 by 2023. That stands in stark contrast to Citigroup's prediction, which sees a barrel of oil dropping to just $54 by the end of next year. Guess time will tell. And mark this down, geography buffs, Jakarta will soon no longer be the capital of Indonesia. The government announced that its new capital will be called Nusantara and located 800 miles away on the island of Borneo. Jakarta is overcrowded, extremely polluted, and one of the world's fastest sinking cities. The government hopes that by moving the capital, it will take some of the environmental pressures off Jakarta. Development of the new capital should start this year and run until 2045, Isabella. And it ain't gonna be cheap to move. It's expected to cost upwards of $30 billion. Well, nice to know moving's expensive for everyone, not just me. Thanks, Louise. For us professional naked people, appearing in Playboy is still a badge of honor. But is Playboy more than meets the eye, or in some ways less? A new series is exploring that, and Maddie's giving us a look right now inside the box. <laughs> 